Good morning, YouTube. How are you doing? She's arrived. So I didn't film a box opening because um, I opened it privately with some friends, which was lovely. Um, and there was only so many screens and I just got carried away with myself. So I didn't do a box opening. But she arrived in this beautiful girly girly box with some goodies, a couple of outfits and a blanket and things. All of those things you don't want to see. I know that. I never want to see them when I see a box opening. But she came with some beautiful things, which I'll show, share in another video, a different video. But for now, I just want to show you my new baby girl. So for those of you that have followed me for a while, um, and you know it's not rocket science, this baby is the um, Mia Sculpt by Izzy Jow, um, painted and rooted by Letitia Moreno, and she came home today, so my little black bird is home, are you ready? Is she not ready? Isn't she beautiful? She is. This everybody is Noah Dillon. Um, at the end of this video, I will put um a picture up of my image. What what I envisaged um. Noah looking like and Letitia has sent a real baby off the page she really truly has and for those of you that followed me for a while um or seen previous videos you'll remember that I had a chat with you guys that you know I was like thinking it through in my head but chatting with you guys about getting um armatures for um Noah and Tamish for that matter and um, that I decided that for me, like customs, it would have just been too much in customs and things. Um, and so I didn't. Um, and I am so glad. I am so glad I didn't. Her movement is just beautiful. Um, it's very fluid. Oh, she's got bed head because she's only just come out of the box. Her movement is really fluid. Go bed, baby. You'll sort that in a minute. Um, you know, she doesn't bounce back, she just stays where I put her. You know, her arms move independently. I don't move one, and then another one moves. She is just beautiful. So, I'm just going to put a blanket down, and then we'll have a little look at her and we'll put some clothes on. Oh, wait. Oh, be Beautiful. She's got a little belly button stump. I don't know if I can, can show you. Her little belly button stump. Um, and I've put um, umbilical tie on. Um, it's just an alternative to the to the plastic cord. I just think it's very sweet um, and I had seen them before but I hadn't thought about it and then one of my friends was like oh what about this so she's got a little umbilical cord tie on she's got the most gorgeous legs um, little feet looks like she's got bones but you know, obviously she hasn't she's got little ankle bones little fat 
can see the hair and the wrinkles. She's sculpted really beautifully and she's a real chubby. She's a real chunker monkey girl. She is definitely going to be an absolute dream to dress because she is just chunky. She's a chunky girl. She's got fat rolls behind her neck. I don't know if I can show you. Come here, little chubs. Oh, like, look at those rolls. Oh, look at your head, but you need to sort that out. Look at those rolls. So she needs her hair doing, but she can be forgiven for that because she's just come out of a box. So we can forgive her that. And we can sort that out, can't we, baby? She is just absolutely gorgeous. I love, I love the sculpting and the painting around her belly button, the dip very newborn and you can't see but she has a fontanelle and her cranial bones are like her sculpting is beautiful absolutely beautiful so I'm just gonna put on her little vest so there's a bazillion outfits that I want to put on this baby um, but actually when when they first come on, I just want to look at her. I don't want to hide a painting. I want to look at it. So I am going to put this on. Now, I would have put it on the other way on. But I don't think it's going to go over a fat bottom. Because she's just a big, fat old girl. So I put it on this way. And then we'll have to sort her hair out at some point. But for now, I'll just leave it be. Mm -hmm. There we go. I'm not sure I'm not even going to fasten it because I want to see her belly button cord. I'll sort her hair out in a second. I just need to brush in the right way. She's so cool. I can't get over how chubby she is. I literally can't stop looking at her. Gonna put her little tiny little sockies on to keep her toes warm. I don't really need sockies on at this time of night, but there we go. Oh, good girl. And I don't know whether to put a scratch mix on. Baby, newborn baby would have them on, wouldn't it? Because. so everyone can see you. You need to go and get your hair brushed to brush your hair. Her hair is beautiful. There she is. You're not scrunched in this way, are you, girly? Oh, let's do you this way. There we go. So she's been home for a good hour or so now, and I just, honestly, I just can't stop staring at her. I can't stop looking at her. She's just beautiful. She really is beautiful. Look at those black rolls I got. Little pudgy cheeks. 
So she is seven pounds eight ounces and she is 20.5 inches. She's a big baby. Um, compared to Hamish, she is a hunk of junk. She's gorgeous. She's like a real nice, a real nice true newborn size. Um, and like I said, the silicone, it doesn't bounce back. It just, she just sits where I want her to sit. She's lovely. Um, she's absolutely gorgeous. So I won't keep you too long. I'm sure I'm going to spam the heck out of you all with um, pictures and stuff of this baby girl. But for now, I'm just soaking her in. And every time I look at her, I find a new detail. We're going to go and brush her hair and um, enjoy her. So thank you for coming along. Thank you for the wait with me. Thank you for putting up with me while I stressed about her coming home. Um, and... I will see you all in the next video. Um, please give it a thumbs up and a like. And um, welcome little Noah Dylan. I'll catch you later. Loves.